Dybala to miss Juventus clash with Chelsea after limping off in tears against Sampdoria as Morata is also ruled out. The Argentina international scored the opener in the Biancaneri's latest Serie A fixture before picking up a knock. Paolo Dybala will miss Juventus' Champions League clash with Chelsea after limping off in tears against Sampdoria with a thigh injury, with Massimiliano Allegri confirming that Alvaro Morata has also been sidelined. Dybala started as captain in Juve's latest Serie A fixture and put them 1-0 up at the Allianz Stadium with a brilliantly struck half volley in the 10th minute. Unfortunately for the Argentina international, he had to be substituted a short while later after picking up a muscle injury, which leaves Allegri short on attacking options ahead of his side's return Champions League action in midweek. Dybala suffered an injury to his left thigh during the game against Sampdoria on Sunday which ended in a 3-2 win for the Biancaneri. He was leading Juve's press in the 20th minute of the game as he closed down a Sampdoria defender with an outstretched leg to try and prevent a long field pass. The 27-year-old landed awkwardly on his front foot and was ultimately unable to continue, with several of his teammates coming over to console him before he made his way down the tunnel. Allegri confirmed that Dybala will miss the next two matches while speaking to Sky Italia after the game and also revealed that Murata picked up a knock that will keep him out for the same length of time. A sad sight to see as goalscorer Paolo Dybala is forced off through injury. Pensive face pick .com LDSL7DR2FK Dybala and Murata will both be assessed by Juve's medical staff when the squad returns to their Contessa training ground on Monday, at which point they will be able to gauge the severity of the injuries. Supporters will hope that the respective issues don't turn out to be too serious, but both men will definitely be absent when the Bianconeri play host to Chelsea on September 29. Allegri will also be without Dybala and Murata when Juve travel to Torino for their next Serie A outing on Saturday, but will hope to have both men back by the time they take on Roma after the international break on October 17. 10 feet Paolo Dybala scores brilliant goal to give Juventus the lead versus Sampdoria soccer ball 22 feet Paolo Dybala limps off injured face with head bandage Juve play Chelsea in the Champions League on Wednesday grimace pick .com slash Nawavici losing Dybala would represent a huge blow for Juve considering how well he has started the 2021-22 season. The diminutive forward has appeared in all six of the club's games in all competitions to date, scoring three goals.